compute the indicated products so we have a set of products so we have to multiply each products let us consider one by one and the first product is the matrix a b minus b a is multiplied with the matrix a minus b b a which is equal to let me consider the first matrix as a into the second matrix as b which is equal to question mark here the order of matrix a is 2 cross 2 and order of matrix b is 2 cross 2 so therefore order of a b will be number of rows of matrix a which is 2 and number of columns of matrix b which is 2 again so we get 2 cross 2 matrix so now a b will be equal to this a b minus b a into a minus b b a let us multiply the first row and the first column first row of a and first column of b gives the first element of the new matrix which is a into a plus b into b and first row with second column which is a into minus b plus b into a and the second row with first column gives the third element which is minus b into a plus a into b next we have my second row and the second column which is minus b into minus b plus a into a which gives we have a into a which is a square plus b into b is b square we get a into minus b which is minus a b plus b into a which is again a b so this is minus b into a which gives minus a b plus a into b which is my a b we have minus b into minus b where minus into minus gives plus so we get b square plus a into a which is a square this is equal to a square plus b square in the second element we have minus a b plus a b which gives zero the third element which is again a minus a b plus a b which gives zero so the last element is a square plus b square is the product of the first equation now let us find the product of the second sub question the second sub question is a column matrix which is 1 2 3 multiplied with the row matrix 2 3 4 which is equal to let us consider the first matrix as a and the second matrix as b is equal to question mark so the order of a here is a column matrix which is of three rows one columns so we get 
3 cross 1 and order of B is a row matrix where we have one row three columns so order of AB will be number of rows of A which is 3 and number of columns of B which is 3 again. So we get 3 cross 3 matrix if we multiply A and B. So the product AB is equal to 1, 2, 3 into 2, 3, 4. which is equal to we have first row is only one number and first column in second matrix one number so multiplying first row into first column we get 1 into 2 and first row with second column gives the second element of first row which is 1 into 3 and we have first row third column which is 1 into 4. Now, second row with first column gives 2 into 2. Second row with second column gives 2 into 3. And second row with last column, which is 2 into 4. And last row will be the last row, first column, which is 3 into 2 last row second column which is 3 into 3 and last row last column which is 3 into 4 this gives the matrix 1 into 2 is 2 1 into 3 is 3 1 into 4 is 4 and the second row is 2 into 2 which is 4 2 into 3 which is 6 2 into 4 which is 8 and the last row is 3 into 2 is 6 3 into 3 9 3 into 4 12 this is the product of A and B now let us consider the third sub question which is in product 1 minus 2 2 and 3 is multiplied with the matrix 1, 2, 3, 2, 3, 1. Let us consider the first matrix as A and the second matrix as B is equal to question mark. So order of A here is 2 cross 2 matrix. And order of B is a 2 cross 3 matrix since we have 3 columns. So, therefore, order of AB will be number of rows of A which is 2 and number of columns of B which is 3. So, we get 2 cross 3 matrix. So, AB is equal to the first matrix which is 1 minus 2, 2, 3 multiplied with 1, 2, 3, 2, 3, 1. This is equal to, so we get again a 2 cross 3 matrix. First, we multiply the first row with the first column in the B matrix which is 1 into 1 plus of minus 2 into 2. And then second element will be first row, second column which is 1 into 2 plus of minus 2 into 3. And the last element of this row is first row multiplied with third column which is 1 into 3 plus of minus 2 into 1. Now, 
multiplying second row with first column gives the second row first element which is 2 into 1 plus 3 into 2 and now second row second column which is 2 into 2 plus 3 into 3 and second row third column which is 2 into 3 plus 3 into 1 this gives the matrix 1 into 1 is 1 we have plus into minus which is minus 2 to the 4 and we have 1 into 2 which is 2 and we have plus into minus minus 2 into 3 is 6 and 1 into 3 is 3 plus into minus is minus 2 into 1 is 2 and second row is 2 into 1 which is 2 plus 3 into 6 3 into 2 which is 6 next we have 2 into 2 4 plus 3 into 3 which is 9 and the last element is 2 into 3 which is 6 plus 3 into 1 which is 3 simplifying this we get minus 3 2 minus 6 gives minus 4 3 minus 2 gives 1 2 plus 6 is 8 4 plus 9 is 13 and the last 6 plus 3 is 9 this is the answer for the third product now let us consider the next product that is fourth one we have the product 2 3 4 3 4 5 4 5 6 is multiplied with the matrix 1 minus 3 5 0 2 4 3 0 5 so let us consider the first matrix as a and the second matrix as b we need to find this product so the order of matrix a is 3 cross 3 matrix and order of matrix B is equal to again a 3 cross 3 matrix therefore order of matrix AB will be equal to Number of rows of first matrix which is A matrix is 3 and number of columns of B matrix which is 3 again. So we get a 3 cross 3 matrix again. So AB is equal to 2, 3, 4, 3, 4, 5, 4, 5, 6 which is multiplied with 1 minus 3 5 0 2 4 3 0 5 let us multiply this product so we get again a 3 cross 3 matrix first multiply the first row with first column so we get 2 into 1 plus 3 into 0 plus 4 into 3 and first row with second column gives 2 into minus 3 plus 3 into 2 plus 4 into 0 and first row with last column which is 2 into 5 plus 
3 into 4 plus 4 into 5. Now, the second row with first column gives the second row first element, which is 3 into 1 plus 4 into 0 plus 5 into 3. And we have second row, second column, which is 3 into minus 3 plus 4 into 2 plus 5 into 0 and second row with last column we have 3 into 5 plus 4 into 4 plus 5 into 5 now multiplying the last row with first column which is 4 into 1 plus 5 into 0 plus 6 into 3 now last row with second column which gives 4 into minus 3 plus 5 into 2 plus 6 into 0 and the last row with last column is 4 into 5 plus 5 into 4 plus 6 into 5 on simplifying this we get 2 into 1 is 2 plus 3 into 0 is 0 plus 4 3 is a 12 in the second element 2 into minus 3 is minus 6 plus 2 into 3 is 6 again plus 4 into 0 will be 0. And the last element of first row is 2 into 5 which is 10 plus 3 into 4 which is 12 plus 4 into 5 which is 20. And second row first element is 3 into 1 which is 3 plus 4 into 0 gives 0 plus 5 into 3 which is 15 and second row second column is 3 into minus 3 which is minus 9 plus 4 into 2 is 8 plus 5 into 0 is 0 and the last element of second row is 3 into 5 which is 15 plus 4 into 4 is 16 plus 5 into 5 which is 25 and last row first element is 4 into 1 which is 4 plus 5 into 0 is 0 plus 6 into 3 which is 18 and second element of the last row is minus 4 minus 4 into 3 which is 12 plus 5 into 2 which is 10 plus 6 into 0 gives 0 and the last row last element is 4 into 5 20 plus 5 into 4 which is 20 plus 6 into 5 which is 30. On simplification, we get 2 plus 12 is 14, minus 6 plus 6 is 0, 20 plus 12 plus 10, which gives 42, 3 plus 15 plus 0, which is 18, minus 9 plus 8, which gives minus 1, 25 plus 16 plus 15, which gives 56 and the last row first element is 4 plus 18 which is 22 and we have minus 12 plus 10 which is minus 2 and the last element 20 plus 20 plus 30 which gives 70. 
is the answer for third fourth sub question and the last sub question is the product 2 1 3 2 minus 1 1 which is multiplied with 1 minus 1 0 2 1 and 1 so let us consider the first element as a and the second matrix as b which is equal to question mark here the order of matrix a is equal to it has three rows and two columns which is three cross two matrix and order of matrix b is equal to a two cross three matrix therefore order of matrix ab the product ab will be equal to number of rows of matrix a which is 3 and number of columns of matrix b which is 3 so we get a 3 cross 3 matrix so ab will be equal to this 2 1 3 2 Minus one one is multiplied with the matrix B, which is one zero one minus one two one. So we get a three cross three matrix on multiplying this matrix. So multiply the first row with first column. Which is two into one plus one into minus one, and first row with second column, two into zero plus one into two, and first row with last column, which is two into one plus one into one. Now, second row with first column, three into one plus Two into minus one. Second row with second column, three into zero plus two into two. And second row with last column, which is three into one plus two into one. And the last row with first column is minus one into one plus. One into minus one minus one into zero plus one into two. The last row with last column is minus one into one plus one into one. Simplifying this, we get two into one, which is two. We have plus one into minus one, which gives minus one. We have two into zero, zero plus one into two is two. And the third element is two into one, which is two plus one into one is one. In the second row, first element is three into one, three plus into minus. We have minus two into one is two. We have three into zero zero plus two into two, which is four. And the last element of second row is three into one, which is three plus two into one is two. And last row, first element is minus one into plus one, which is minus one. We have again plus one into minus one. It gives again a minus one. So minus one into zero gives zero. Plus one into two is two, and we have minus one into one, which is minus one. Plus one into one, which is one. 
this is equal to 2 minus 1 gives 1, 0 plus 2 gives 2, 2 plus 1 gives 3, 3 minus 2 which is 1, 0 plus 4 is 4, 3 plus 2 is 5, minus 1, minus 1 gives minus 2, 0 plus 2 gives 2, minus 1 plus 1 will be 0. is the answer for the fifth product.